Welcome aboard, Captain. Power restored. All primary systems online. Right, so guys, back to Subnautica, and I think it's about time to head back over to that ship and try some welding. Grab some food. Make sure I don't die. Because that's been happening quite a lot. I forget to feed myself. Also, got to keep an eye out for this stupid sea monster that keeps on coming all the time. Seems to make nothing better than making my life a misery by hunting us down and killing us every time I get anywhere close to that bloody ship. really don't like it when you start cutting down the creek pines. I suppose one of the best things is, is when you find a stalker there's always a shitload of scrap metal up there. Which I suppose always makes for an advantage really doesn't it? I know somewhere around the centre there was a hole in the middle, which is what I used yesterday to come out of, so I should be able to just, really, just go straight back in through there. The problem is finding it. Oh, 
Hold on, this could be it. Yeah, this is it. Daylight this time, so it seems a bit easier to navigate through rather than just end up everywhere. I've been told once all this is welded, there is an island somewhere mapping around. And I think I'm going to need to make a couple of the sea crafts to go exploring. Remaining leaks and nine, nine more. I have noticed um, some of those weird little Grabby fish knocking around in here as well, though. Look, we though, I now have the upgraded air tank, so I can stay underwater a bit longer. Which is always a bit of an advantage. Yeah, water survival again. which is a bit of a shame. Personally, thing you could do with being a lot bigger as well. Because there's only like one route to go to explore, there doesn't seem to be anything else like hidden around, it's all just this or nothing. And on the outside of the ship's absolutely ginormous. I mean, they could put quite a lot more stuff in it. Attention. High energy particle containment field restored. Auto decontamination sequence initiated. Aquatic radiation levels are estimated to return to safe levels in T minus three days. So uh, three days, ten hours, and we'll eventually be back to being able to swim without the radiation suit. I'm just going this way out, guys, because in case you haven't seen the ship, it's a quick look at the ship. There's not a great lot of sea. There's one passageway. There is other areas. I mean, that's blocked off. I see one straight passage back out and where it comes from. There was a few more of these little boxes to pick up knocking around with it, but they didn't give you a great lot. There's these horrible little jumpy crabs, but I'll just stay away from them, they're not too bad. It basically just goes along that path. You come in, you come down there, and that's it. The absolute worst part is the sea monster that seems to stalk the area. Well, tip or two running into, I haven't got that much to lose. And chances of running into him seem to be quite high. Every time I've been over here, he's been here waiting for us. And he, he ate us once yesterday and I managed to escape away from him once. But once he's got a hold of you, there just doesn't seem to be any getting off. He's got these big horrible ass claws on the front. Caution. 
caution. Mild dehydration detected. Well, this looks like it might be a nice area to go explore. seen these before. Don't know if they're friendly or not, but they don't seem to be bothering us. I'll take some of that tree Warning. mission. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Seem to be able to pick that up. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. I am stuck and I am dead. <sighs> Lost me fish. Oh, sorry, I had to need it. I had to give me full health again. I think I need to go explore and get some bits and pieces. Like I found yesterday, the best place to go um, picking up bits and pieces is down at the red corals. I do actually want to make this heat blade because apparently it cooks the fish as you get them. I might be able to make it straight away. Just need to find out what I need for a battery. Asset mushrooms and copper ore. Silver ore instead of the cup ore. Yeah. Apparently this one automatically cooks your fish. Right, I'm gonna pop out and give this a try. Apparently it's quite weak though, so it, mm, probably best just to use it literally on the fish. happens I want to catch something there's never any ability about you don't want them they're bloody everywhere Yes, I'm. Oh, that's quite handy. 
Actually quite a good item. Not advisable to use it just for the general breaking of everything though. Just quickly get some air and then I'm going to come back in here and explore this. Emergency. Emergency. Ten seconds of oxygen remaining. Completely pressed the wrong button. I hear it when the air floater comes out. That just leads back to the outside. I think that's just back outside over there now. It doesn't look like there was a great lot to explore here. That's a shame. Big ugly fella. Oh dear. They come up with hands, so I'm just wondering if I can actually pick them up. Yes, before they explode all over us. that poor big fella alone. I'm like the advantage of this heat knife. It saves time to go all the way back to base just to cook your fish. I do like the fact that you can actually eat it underwater as well. It's always a little bit funny that, that you can eat and drink while you're underwater. You've got a big mask on, but you can stuff your face and drink your water. Full, as always. Quick enough, see, sometimes I'll run them explodey fish. I've got myself lost, I can't remember how the hell I got in here, how to get out. There we are. I'm gonna head back to the aqua shack and 
convert this stuff into titanium and then I am going to go have my tea. Where's the food pot gone off me survival gear? <laughs> Is that because I've now got that thing that I can't actually do it? I could do with some glass because I want to make a see through the um, upper extension. Oh, it's out of bloody power. I need, I need another solar panel as well. I don't think I picked up any gold. No. I guess I should be back later. 